Hey, you ready to go up creek? Without a paddle? Yeah, we don't need one while we're going. Oh good, because we didn't bring the canoe. Yeah, and that's what the cache is called, up a creek. <sighs> we're gonna be up the creek pretty soon. Yep, an oldie cache, right close to home. Come on with us. Let's go. Well, we could just cross right here. Wait a minute, there is a sign. So we should just keep going. I was just tempted to uh, cross where we could, but I wanted to see where the original waypoints led and to see if there was even a bridge there. And just up, there's a bridge. Not sure what condition it's in, but that's supposed to be the crossing point. Waypoint number one. Bridge. Okay, so we're 27 meters from the waypoint number two, which is a pile of lumber. And we're back to where we started from. We started at <laughs> 247 meters away, and that's where we're at. And what does the waypoint say once we get to the lumber? Because it's a straight route from here. We turn left. We turn left at the pile of lumber. Okay, let's go up the trail. Watch out for ATVs. All right. Well, over 20 years, the pile of lumber has changed a bit. So what, do we should, what should we do? Well, let's keep following the trail right. and see where it leads. Okay. So she says uh, follow the trail, and I'm thinking we're going to do that because the waypoint said a pile of lumber, and if that was it, it said carry on up the creek, so then the creek is that way. And if we keep going that way, it's going away from the cache, which is over that way. So we're going to follow the trail, like she said, and turn left. Met up with the old trail, and my my coordinates say it's just up ahead. So let's go. It's supposed to be on the base of a tree. Well camoed. Right over here. Oh, look at that! Under a suspicious pile of logs. You mean like right there? Yeah. That be it. There we go. There we go. We found her. The coordinates were pretty good, Yeah, we're about four meters from here. Yep, there we go. And I believe from the pictures and the description, this is the original container from 2001, cool. and one, 19 years ago. That's an oldie. So this is an April 2001 cache, a real oldie for this area. Yep, and this is the oldest cache that we don't have closest to home. Uh, I don't know why we haven't gotten this one before, but uh, we finally we're set out today. And there are 177 year 2001 caches in Canada. So uh, we're starting to kind of look. We're looking at Ontario to see what we can clear for the 2001. There are a lot of people uh, that do that in Ontario and they're trying to clear the entire province. Sweat 31 is one of those caches that's trying to clear out all those old 2001. And he runs a group called? Sweating for the oldies. Okay, we're not going that way. <laughs> we'll have to find another route. Let's go. I think go. we'll have to go to the left. We found a way across that we could ford the creek, but we've got to go from here down to it. Let's go.
you know, that wasn't as bad as I thought. Oh, what did you think we were going to bushwhack the whole way? Oh, I thought we were going to be swimming, you know, in our undies Not crossing today. the creek. <laughs> yeah, because uh, if you look at the images from the cash page, mm -hmm. a lot of people are going through the creek. <laughs> yeah, fortunately where we crossed, the water wasn't very yeah. deep. Yeah, so that's pretty cool to get another oldie uh, all done. Especially so close to home. Yeah. Keep watching, there's more caches to be found. Yeah, where will geocaching take, take you. you? I got nothing more.